Currently on my main account, I'm working on something. I need to get my skills up and it's gonna take a while. So I thought instead of waiting for like six days for the video, I'm gonna include this one. This is not my main account. This is uh, not going towards my zero GP to one billion so I can lose as much money as I want, which I somehow doubt that I will in this video, but we're gonna see it's quite an interesting experiment. You see on Reddit, you see a lot of these posts where people are like, they put some weird item for 5 million and waited one year for it to finally sell because somebody misclicked or maybe they just didn't care. What if today I tried to buy out like the weirdest items in the game, put in 100 mil as an offer. Like what if I try to do this right now? Let, let's see, big pirate hat, what is that even? The buy limit is four as well, let's see. Ooh, you see, this is a uh, spooky here yeah. on these items. Okay, I got nine. Okay, it was actually 50k. Now you see, this can be easily fake. That's why I didn't want to trust too many of them on Reddit. Let's say if I buy 20,000 fire runes, which you sell instantly. Now, if I try to buy another fire rune, I just hit the limit. So I shouldn't be able to buy a single fire rune for 99 million. It should, shouldn't sell. You see, even though there are offers, but because I hit the limit, I cannot do that. However, I can just go ahead and try to sell one fire rune for six coins and I just sold it for 99 million. When it looks crazy, but I also got all the money back in here. So now if we check the history, we can see that I bought a fire rune for 99 mil and I sold a fire rune for 99 mil. That's the thing, that's how easily it could be faked on Reddit. Now we're gonna try to put this in a test, like I said, and I'm not gonna try it obviously on every single item like fire runes, Zolara scales, Bandos, God Swords, because these are traded. Most likely there's always like thousands of these items in the Grand Exchange, so there is no use to try them. However, now I'm used into pirate stuff, like these bandanas and stuff, you know, you never know. Pirate leggings, let's say, right? We gonna have to put 99 mil instead of 100 mil. Okay, this was 1,000 coins. I wanna see what's gonna be the highest. God damn it, there's a lot of items to buy. I wanna switch to something else. Oh, 30,000, there we go, for these likes. That was the lowest offered. If you really wanted these, you would have to pay 30,000 unless you wanna wait for potentially a few hours because this item, who trades this? Like who buys a bunch of these? So now I wanna move to these pre-made gnome items cause I needed one for the quest. I think it was the Toad Crunchies, these. Uh, this was for mornings and part one and I had to pay like 9K for them. So this could be like whoever. <laughs> I love the buy limit, 6,000 by the way. No one's gonna be buying 6,000 or actually no one's gonna be selling 6,000 either. Let's pay 99 mil for one of these. Let's go baby. Oh. I somehow thought that I paid one mil because I saw 98 mil. I actually paid one coin. Ooh, we did it for one million, dude. That guy, if this guy posts on Reddit, whoever sold this thing, one million, we did it. Yes, we found the item. Somebody actually put this in an... This is so weird because one of them, some guy sells 200 of them for one GP. And then this guy just puts for 1 million and he sold it. Today he's gonna wake up and he's like, I did it. Nice, dude. I made some guy 1 mil richer. I hope that guy was some noob. Oh my god, another one. These pre made items. <laughs> 2 million for pre made chocolate Sunday. Look, if I try to sell it back, I, I somehow doubt that I will. Oh, I actually did. There we go. What do you think? Good flipping? Enjoy the two million, my friend. Oh, it's these punches, man. It's these drinks. I don't know. No way. I didn't even think about this, that some items may not sell completely. Wait, I gotta cancel this offer because if somebody puts this in, I may sell it for 90 million. It would literally sell for 90 million because that, uh, that's the highest buying offer. Can you imagine? If at some point you're just chilling and trying to sell these items. As a joke, you put one of them in the Grand Exchange and it just sells for 90 million. So this is the very first item that I couldn't buy. See, it has a 2000 buy limit. I, I, I'm not on the limit. Okay, you can check the history. It's actually legit that we're not a single off. I don't know how to look for the other items though. Like, what do I type? Amulet of Chemistry. Never heard of it, but probably people are using it. 
Maybe these bagged. Like, who needs a bagged willow tree? It's not... Ah, probably for farming training, because you can get construction and farming in early levels. So these could, uh, yeah, 16k. So you can convert most of the furniture into these things. I don't even know how you put them back. I never literally use these. Ooh, half a million, even though the medium price was 33k. <gasps> That's the highest, currently. Think of it, who would make something like this? Wow, dude, four million. Let's go to history, look. Uh, some of these were actually, you see, I bought this one for 547, I sold back for half a million. So it may seem like it's a lot, but they're actually worth something because you know, the ingredients to make them, but damn, <laughs> a wooden bench. I just bought a wooden bench for four million. It's the bed, 90 mil, let's go. <gasps> It's not selling, dude. You had a chance as well. Cancel, cancel. <laughs> we got two items. I gotta, I gotta type them on a notepad. Maybe one of the weirder items also, like Iron Javelin P+, plus, specifically one of those weirder poisons as well. There's only 7 GP, but how many do you... I, I don't think anything drops them. So you actually have to manually poison them. I don't have 90 mil anymore. I forgot about that. 37k. <laughs> See, I like this. I'm educating myself what is possible through the Grand Exchange. That's the purpose of this video. Look at this. Bronze javelins are more expensive than Addy javelins. Confirmed. What is this? You think uh, anyone would buy? Oh, it's probably for uh, ballista it's used. So I think these, I don't know. I'm guessing that people are using these for ballista. <gasps> Cancel. Hot. I don't have 90 mil anymore. I always forget. Let's put it for 80 mil. 50k. Come on, you put the wrong poison on. You don't do P plus, they're only 50k. You do the normal poison, they go for 90 mil. <laughs> you see, most of these are going high in price. People just leave offers on like alternative accounts and yeah, over time you could potentially. I don't, I don't know who would buy them. Like I, I'm doing this for a video, but other than that, like what's, who? who? Who would even think? What about Hastas? Nobody would like buy bronze Hasta P++. Actually, I have a feeling P++, sure, somebody may buy it for like Fashionscape. One mil. Oh, another one. It's been a while. I, again, I'm supporting these guys. Okay. It's not money lost. Oh my God, you're losing so much money. I'm supporting back the community. The, the flipping guys. Oh, another one. We have something that is not selling at all 80 million for oak blackjack what about the oak blackjack oh i actually have no idea i know one of them is offensive one of them is oh yeah that's what it means O is offensive i think yep an offensive blackjack i remember from the quest this one is also not selling <laughs> no one no one's these are just not traded at this point at least we have one of these it's expensive so people probably are making these though Oh, 750k for this one. I think it's called like this mature. Yes, 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 yes. So we got into another wormhole. Okay, let's see. Moonlight Mead. Med. I, I, I don't know. I don't know how it's called. 20k. Axeman's Folly. I think this one is the one that gives you wood cutting. So maybe people are actually using them, but then you have Dragon Axe, which would be probably cheaper to buy, although you have to, you need attack level to equip it. 179k for this one. Asgarnian Ale, 80 mil. Ooh, we got another item that we couldn't buy. I'll just chill a little bit. Ah, should we wait like five minutes just to see if somebody sells this or not? No, probably not. Then the video would end. That's the thing. This is how you could rig the prices on OS Buddy. If now I was logged in in OS Buddy, I could log in on my other account, put in the offer for 80 million, and it would show on OS Buddy as an actual transaction. So if somebody looks up this item, which I don't know if in the history anyone ever looked this up, they would be like, oh my God, somebody actually bought this for 80 million. And the mature one just is, is not even selling. Oh, I forgot about these mixes. Yes. 
Oh my god, there's so many of these. I only have 79 mil left now for one coin. Okay. Now we have a lot of these, so let's try out Antidote. <laughs> 200k. <laughs> Here we go. That's what I thought. What the hell is this? Wow. A kebab mix. Almost 1 million. I think that's uh, when you try to make some food, but it's not completely finished. You can't even eat that. Oh, we have another item that's not selling. Not even two dose potion. Oh man. This one is also, that's a different one, okay? This is super anti-fire. Okay, so I think I'm gonna end the video here because I got a general idea of how items work and I just don't wanna, you know, pointlessly lose more money. I already lost around 22 million. But before I go, one last time, the very first item that I tried to buy, which was this one, I couldn't buy it for 90 mil. It's been probably like an hour or so now since I tried to buy it. I'm wondering if anyone put any offers for this one. Let's put in the whole cash stack, 78 million. No, no one restocked it. All right. Oh, I totally forgot. These are all the items that I couldn't buy in the grand exchange for 90, 80 or 70 million. Grand exchange is a very weird place.